What's up guys, Pronto here, I got some more Detroit Lions franchise for you. In this game, we are playing the Atlanta Falcons, and we are playing at home. And in future games from now on, I think, I'm going to uh, kind of introduce you to the other team, show you how their quarterback, their uh, stats are going, and uh, how we're doing so far in the season, just to open up videos a bit better than just going straight into the game but anyways let's get into the game now that i said that that after a run by best i try to force that to pettigrew because nobody else was covered and it gets picked off by dent there and now on their drive ndamaka sue is gonna say give us that right back and williams is gonna recover the fumble that sue forces so we got the ball right back and i'm going play action this is our play this is the money play and I give it to Pettigrew as always. And that's that That play uh, is executed at least three times a game. I use it at least three times a game. And look at Stafford rumbling right there, breaking tackles to get the first down. Hard fought four yards there, and he makes it work. And here, I'm going to find a wide open Maurice Stovall, who's going to take it in the end zone for a TD. We're up seven to nothing. And right here, off play action, Van Bosch is going to take down Matt Ryan to get the second sack for the Detroit Lions of the game. And now move it into the second quarter. Right after that one sack, he gets it off to Michael Turner, who's going to take it up all the way to the house. He was about to get sacked before he gave it to Turner, if you go back and watch that. But... He got it off. And Bess weaves through a couple of defenders there. And he takes it up for a nice seven-yard gain. Here, Stafford's going to take it up himself and slide for the first down. So he's already got two rushes in there so far. And I'm dropping way too far back right now. Luckily, I don't get sacked. And Burleson ends up catching that inbounds. So we get the first down. Here, I'm doing a fake little HB pass to Best. And he makes a move to put us up at the 8-yard line. Nice little trickery there by the Detroit Lions. And here, I was about to get off a pass, but I get sacked. And right away, I'm trying to run it again, but Stafford is not fast enough. He does get injured, but he will be fine. He'll be back in the game. And I miss a tackle after covering Douglas there. And Douglas is going to take that advantage and take it all the way to the house to put him up. 14 to 10 almost said seven we already packed on a field goal and now i'm gonna bomb it deep to calvin johnson jr who's gonna climb the ladder and pull that one down and then i see burleson calling for it so i'm gonna give it to you burleson he's gonna take it up so it's second and four stafford drops back to pass and he can't find anybody so he gets brought down and it's third and 14 after a 10 yard loss on that sack and uh, Stafford decides to hurry up offense and call an audible right before the second half winds down. And I'm going to try to force that to Megatron. And he, I should have actually gave that to Stovall. He was pretty wide open there if you go back and watch that. Might have been a touchdown. Who knows? But it happened nonetheless. Michael Turner now takes it up for a first down. And they're doing a little bit of motion here. I thought they were going to go to the run. They're not. Kelly is wide open down the side, and he takes that up for a 15-yard gain. Here's Matt Ryan looking for somebody. That's Smith's ball. He almost drops the ball, and he's got open field in front of him. The 20, the 10, end zone. He takes that in for an INT score, a pick six, and we're up 17-14. to 14. Now Best doing work like he usually doesn't. <laughs> on the rushing plays he usually is not that good of a rusher but he actually had over 100 yards at that moment with 10 carries so he's averaging over 10 yards which is awesome he gets us that touchdown we're up 24 to 14 and jackson takes down matt ryan in the backfield once again heavy pressure on matt ryan and uh turner there drops the ball on the screen and best doing what he does best in this game, taking it up for another plus 10-yard gain. And Matt Ryan here finding Jones. He's going to shed a tackle and bowl over Spivey, but he gets taken down. But a 24-yard gain, pretty big gain there. Now he's going to turn to the run game once again. 
but he gets taken down second and three now so they got a chance to get back in there there's still three minutes left in the fourth quarter matt ryan back to pass finds tony gonzalez over the middle for a 14 yard gain he's calling no huddle what's gonna happen here we almost get offside but matt ryan looking once again he gets it blocked the defensive lineman and now stafford calling some audibles and he's going to be looking for Tony Gonzalez once again. Tony Gonzalez is going to duck his head, but Smith takes him down. But another first down for Tony there. And Matt Ryan and the Falcons are pushing up into our red zone. And we're going to see what they can do here. And he was trying to look for, I think that was, yes it was, Gonzalez again. But it gets batted down. Second and 10, and he finds Weems over the middle. And that's an injury, and they end up having to punt that one away and Stafford dropping way too far back sacked for a 12 yard loss there so we got to make something happen he almost almost gets safetyed but luckily he gets that off to Megatron who reels it in for a huge gain and now Best going out of the shotgun getting another 10 yard gain for the first down Best doing work this game and now Stafford dropping back way too far like I said before he I kind of worked on that now. I'm trying to get close to the line of scrimmage, scrimmage each and every game. I almost said scrimmage. But anyways, long ball here, and Roddy White comes down with it, but time expires, so they're not able to get that extra touchdown to tie the game up. We end up pulling that victory out, 24-17. Alonzo Smith is a player of the game with that pick six he got earlier in the game. That was a huge play for us, and we needed an extra touchdown to come over him so it definitely helped us out in the long run here's some highlights real quick but that's pretty much it for the video i hope you guys enjoy i hope you guys are enjoying madden franchise detroit lions franchise because i am so there you go i'll see you in the next franchise video peace out